All babies cry for many different reasons. In this film, you'll learn how to recognise some of the common causes and what you can do to help. Sometimes parents think that when a baby cries, that it must be because they're hungry. And actually babies cry for lots of different reasons. It is a really effective way of communicating that they need something from their carers. Uh, but it may not always be because they're hungry. They may cry also because they're lonely and they need a cuddle, or they may feel uncomfortable. They may have a tummy ache, have wind, or need a nappy change, or have some other need that they're communicating through crying that isn't about feeling hungry on that occasion. So when a baby's hungry, they will usually uh, show a, a group of behaviours all clustered together. The sorts of things that they might be doing would be some of the obvious things like they might cry and they may be quite tense and quite uh, so sh show some quite fussy sorts of behaviours. Crying is also an effective way for your baby to tell you they need a change or have had enough of something. Crying is saying, I need something different to happen here, I need some help. Um, and crying can happen, I guess, for a, n a number of reasons during an interaction. And one of those reasons may be that the baby is being overstimulated. You've had enough, haven't you? Yes. Yeah. The parent or the caregiver thinks they're helping the baby and entertaining the baby by, for instance, shaking a rattle or showing a number of toys to the baby. Actually, sometimes that can be a bit overwhelming for a baby and they may need a bit of space. And they would demonstrate that feeling of being overwhelmed by crying. It's important to remember that your own mood can have a big effect on your baby. Babies are very sensitive to the mood of the caregiver. And when a caregiver is feeling really stressed and anxious, then a baby can um, pick up on that and actually that sometimes can make the baby cry even more. So it is worthwhile taking a little break and moving away from the baby to reduce your anxieties and reduce your stress, even if it's just for one or two minutes, and then coming back to it when you're feeling a little bit better. For information on more prolonged episodes of crying and how to respond to them, there's another film you can watch in the Understanding Your Baby series.